I had my Facebook login details stolen and hackers impersonated me and sent messages to my friends. They claimed I'd been attacked and robbed in Rome, that I was in hospital and that I urgently needed money. They started sending requests to my friends asking for eight and a half thousand dollars in cash to be wired to a Western Union account. I immediately emailed Facebook, but by then one of my friends had already transferred $750 in what must have been the hacker's account. I wrote warning messages on Facebook, but the hackers deleted these and changed my password while constantly asking my friends for money. I have hundreds of friends on Facebook, so I couldn't get a hold of everyone straight away. I also didn't have everyone's email addresses or phone numbers to be able to warn them. It makes me sick that these criminals took advantage of the kindness of my friends. I was being bullied at school, on the internet and via SMS. I felt like I couldn't escape it. Every single day, I would go to school and go through being bullied. Every morning, I would wake up with this horrible feeling about going back there. However, the bullying didn't end when I came home. I was constantly receiving mean text messages. They also hacked into my Facebook and MSN Messenger accounts and posted nasty messages. I lost so many friends through that. I just felt really lonely and felt like there was absolutely no reason for me to be here anymore. I couldn't sleep and had low energy. I would deliberately miss my school bus so I would not have to sit with the people who were bullying me. My teachers had no idea. I didn't tell my parents either because I thought they would stop me from using the internet and take away my phone. After I attempted suicide, I was discovered by a family member and spent two nights in hospital. I was so ashamed to have even thought about doing that. I can't believe I would have left my little sister. 